Way back in elementary school, most of us learned that light is comprised of a spectrum of colors. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, violet. We're even taught to remember that by the acronym Roy G. Biv. We can see that spectrum in the sky when a rainbow appears. What we don't see so clearly is the blue light that comes from the screens of devices like computers, tablets, and even phones. Nor do we realize how harmful that blue light can be. Well, when I'm on a computer or really any other digital device for a long period of time, my eyes tend to feel really tired, and my vision can even get blurry sometimes. And the thing is, that tiredness and fatigue I feel in my eyes doesn't always just stay there. I mean, sometimes it can spread to my brain and affect how I think and how I act. And I mean, the whole thing just makes me feel really unproductive and tired. Lila was suffering from digital eye strain. That's eye strain caused in part by the blue light from her computer. And I'm just gonna use the light first and take a look. Dr. Ronnie Bannock is an ophthalmologist. That's a medical doctor who specializes in treating diseases and disorders of the eye. She's also Lila's mom. So, why is blue light harmful? So blue light is short wavelength, high energy light. So if you think about the whole rainbow, it's on one end of the spectrum. And these high energy wavelengths can actually get into the back of the eye. So they're not filtered out by the front of the eye. They can get into the back of the eye and potentially, because they are high energy, cause harm to our retinas. To be clear, we're talking about the blue light from digital screens. Most experts agree that the blue in sunlight is beneficial. It gives us energy, improves our memory and attention, and makes us happy. But blue light at night from devices like computers can cause eye strain. And it also affects our melatonin. That's a hormone our body produces at night to make us tired and signal it's time to sleep. So one of the best ways to avoid the harmful effects of blue light is to increase our natural blue blockers in our eyes. And a lot of people don't realize that we actually have internal blue blockers in the retina. These are three pigments that nature put there to absorb blue light and prevent it from doing any harm. These three pigments have fancy names. They're called lutein, zeaxanthin, and mesozeaxanthin. So this is really a mouthful to say. It's hard to remember, but these are important pigments. We can get them from foods. For example, lots of green leafy vegetables vegetables, yellow and orange vegetables and fruits like orange peppers or corn. Some spices even have lutein and zeaxanthin. The third pigment, the mesozeaxanthin, is not readily available in foods. But it's hard to eat our way to healthier eyes. To boost our blue blockers, Dr. Bannock recommends taking a daily supplement. There is an ingredient that has all three of those pigments I mentioned that's found in many, many supplements on the market. So if you look at the back of the bottle, look for Ludamax 2020, and that will automatically give you those three pigments in the right ratio we're supposed to have. And it's found in many, many different brands on the market. So just look at the label. Hopefully, you found the connection between eye strain and the blue light from digital devices illuminating. For Teen Kids News, I'm Dean.